Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll show you how you can fix the issue if you're encountering the error. Safari could not install a profile due to an unknown error on your iPhone or iPad. Let's get started on how to resolve this problem. First, open settings and ensure you are using a strong internet connection. If you're on Wi-Fi, try disconnecting and reconnecting. If you're using mobile data, turn it off and then turn it back on. After doing this, check if the issue is resolved. If not, you may need to clear Safari's history and website data. To do this, open Settings, scroll down and tap on Safari. Then scroll down again and select Clear History and Website Data. Choose All History and make sure Close All Tabs is turned on before tapping Clear History. Afterward, see if the problem persists. If the issue continues, try restarting your iPhone. To restart, quickly press and release the volume up button, then quickly press and release the volume down button. Next, press and hold the power button until the Apple logo appears on your screen. Check if this resolves the issue. If restarting doesn't help, check if your iOS version is up to date. Open Settings, scroll down, and tap on General. Then select Software Update. Ensure you have the latest version of iOS installed. If not, update your device and see if the problem is fixed. Another step is to check your VPN settings. Open Settings, tap on General, and scroll down on the VPN and Device Management. Make sure you are not connected to a VPN. If you are, disconnect and try again. Additionally, verify that your date and time settings are correct. Open Settings, tap on General, and then Time and Date. Ensure that your date and time are accurate and that it's automatically set. After adjusting, check if the issue is resolved. If the problem persists, you may need to reset your network settings. Open Settings, then tap on General. Scroll down and select Transfer or Reset iPhone. Then tap on Reset and choose Reset Network Settings. Enter your iPhone password when prompted and see if this fixes the issue. If none of these steps resolve the problem, you might need to perform a factory reset of your iPhone. Open Settings, tap on General, scroll down to Transfer or Reset iPhone, and select Erase All Content and Settings to perform a factory reset. And that's it for today's video. Hopefully, these steps help you resolve the issue. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to the channel and press that bell icon so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Thank you!